I'm all been here from Entertainment Stop and today I'm going to do an honest trailer reaction of Friends by the YouTube channel Scream Junkies. So let's take a look. You watched it for free on TV. Then you paid to watch the reruns on DVD. You paid to watch the reruns again on cable. And you paid to watch the reruns again again on Netflix. Now, get ready to pay HBO Max to watch the same reruns again, again, again. Only this time, it comes with an all-new reunion special. Again. That's been indefinitely postponed. Yeah, it hasn't really been our day. Or week, or month, or even our year. Friends. Welcome to Turn of the Century New York, where coffee shops are more than just a place to charge your phone. The sweaters are extra chunky, and the furniture etiquette is just awful. Get your feet off the couch! No shoes on the furniture! And meet the friends. There's Joey, an aspiring actor slash human garbage disposal. Hey, how much you give me to eat this whole jar of olives? Cold cuts, ice cream, limes. Custard, good. Jam, good. Meat, good. Monica, a chef with some seriously undiagnosed OCD. You see these little flower blossoms? They should be facing up, not down, because, well, the head of the bed is where the sun would be. You want to put the marshmallows in concentric circles. You don't know the system! Don't be nobody messing with the system! Her brother Ross, who goes from depressed nerd. Hi. 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 Someone at work ate my sandwich. To manic, unstable buffoon in 10 short years. Be careful! Very hot plate! Very hot! Ross, you don't even have oven mitts on! <laughs> Great! <laughs> A sentient haircut who can only speak in complaints. My life officially sucks. So, this is Brooklyn. He made Rachel cry. Rachel always cries. <laughs> That's not true. Chandler, an insecure man child who uses humor to run away from his psychological issues. I have issues with commitment, intimacy. I make jokes when I'm uncomfortable. I'm hopeless and awkward and desperate for love. And Phoebe. She's a wannabe musician with a mother who committed suicide. My mom killed herself. A father who abandoned her. My real dad's the one that ran in on us before I was born. And a stepfather in prison. You know how my stepdad's in prison? Causing her to grow up in the streets. I was living in a box. I used to beg for money. Someday I'll tell you about the time I stabbed the cop. Whose estranged identical twin stole her identity to do porn. Stop using my name and shame on you. And the dead woman she thought was her mother wasn't actually her mother and her real mother was alive the whole time. I'm your mother. Eh? You know what? This is too depressing. <laughs> Let's just call her the weird one. The only guy I've ever been crazy about is the one the mints can have my never I may never see him again. <laughs> <laughs> That's our Phoebe. If you want to know what New York was like in the 90s, read a history book or something? I don't know. But if you want to know what a sitcom set in New York in the 90s was like, Friends is the show for you. Watch these sporadically unemployed 20-somethings live in multi-million dollar apartments. And it's a good thing that there's no crime because these doors will never be locked. We have got to start locking that door. <laughs> that would be a sensible idea. Watch as they consume some of the finest legally clearable products of the decade, like Daani water. Villa Wafers, Diet Napple, Quran Beer, Vinod Vaya, and Sprito. All set against Network TV's version of New York's True Melting Pot, featuring a diverse cast of characters like... Okay, let's see here. Oh, here we go. Waiter. Receptionist. Son will be right with you. Clerk. How can I help you? Co-worker you never see again. Sassy. I shared my pudding with you, man. Mm. Seems like I would have remembered you. And two of Ross's short-term girlfriends. Come on, everybody, at least they tried. Let's give them a round of applause for doing the bare minimum. <laughs> Through it all, experience the ups and downs of one of TV's worst love stories, Ross and Rachel, two of the least compatible people in entertainment history. Watch this neurotic intellectual and this spoiled anti-intellectual clash as... 
Ross likes Rachel, then Rachel likes Ross, but Ross has a girlfriend, so Ross dumps his girlfriend and dates Rachel, but they immediately break up, then get back together, then go on a break, then break up again, then Rachel decides she likes Ross again, so he dumps another girlfriend, then they immediately break up, then Rachel wants Ross back, so he says the wrong name at the altar and gets divorced, but now Ross doesn't want to get together, then they get drunkenly married in Vegas, then divorced, then Ross gets Rachel pregnant, but they don't get back together, but also they're jealous of each other, but also they still decide not to get together, Rachel decides to move to Paris and rejects Ross, but then immediately changes her mind, and they actually do get together just in time for the series finale. Oh, what are you people cheering for? I give this thing 10 minutes tops. So settle in to binge one of the most iconic sitcoms of all time, featuring all the unforgettable moments you love. Tibet! Shenandler Ball. Regina Falange. Dr. Drake Ramore. We were on a break! Just know what you're signing up for, because when you watch this weekly show all at once, you start noticing things like how inexplicably horny the characters are. Stop staring at my breasts. Nice and tight. There it is. When's the dirty stuff starting? How, uh, cold the studio is. Can you see my nipples through this shirt? The thin layer of gay panic that covers everything. Let your wrist go. Not so much. Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> What's my boy doing with the Barbie? So how goes the dancing? Gay yet? Ah, I see what you mean. That's quite nice. <laughs> More food and beer. Yeah. And the realization that every character in the show has just one reaction to literally anything that happens. Oh my god. 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 Stop it. Starring Cougar Town Origins, Bangs of New York, Ross Dress for Less, Fiona Crapple, Matt LeBlanc Look on His Face, The Bing Bang Theory, Poultry, The Jenny, <laughs> The One from Screen Junkies, Hooking Up with Relatives. You don't kiss your friend's mom. You think it would be okay if I asked out your sister? I fooled around with Joey's sister. Get off my sister! Chandler getting handsy. I have her panties right there in my drawer. Mine is the red one. You took your eggs and you left. This is smack dab in the middle of the blue. Capital R, capital T. I want to go through the tunnel to the other side. You're the worst best man ever! You freaked out! Don't judge me, I'm only human! Could I be? Could that report be any later? Could these margaritas be any stronger? Could that shot be any prettier? Could I be wearing any more clothes? Could I be any more turned on? Could I be more sorry? <laughs> Bad dancing! Ugly naked guy's laying kitchen tile. Ugly naked guy's taking his turkey out of the oven. Ugly naked guy's decorating his tree. Ugly naked guy's using his new hammock. Ugly naked guy's got a naked friend. Ugly naked guy looks awfully still. 90 stuff. Since when do you rollerblade? Laser disc marathon. Walker, Texas Ranger. Jasmine Bleak. Sony PlayStation. Michael Flatley, Lord of the Dance. Joey Botafuca. Swing dance lessons. What about those Goodwill hunting guys? Tom Hanks, Meg Ryan, they get mail. Y2K panic. Chicken soup for the soul? Which one was Deep Impact and which one was Armageddon? Stephen Baldwin! Mia Hamm? Mia Hamm! Got milk. I read about it in Maxim. Stupid gap on every corner! How you doing? 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 How you are doing? Guest stars! Hey. And twins 
Have you got a minute? Are you a uh, friend of Rachel's? I found my identical hand to it. You know it's twins, right? Oh, yeah. Where could I find someone who looks exactly like me? Dear white people. So, did Joey star in an early off-Broadway production of Interstellar? I'm gonna get on this spaceship. <laughs> but when I return, 200 years from now, you'll be long gone. <laughs> but I won't have aged at all. So long, Vic! Need more friends? Click left to find more shows that'll scratch that friend's itch. And click right to hang out with your Screen Junkies friends on SJU, our daily pop culture morning show. Pivot, pivot, pivot. How you doing? Well, that was um, the Friends um, Honest trailer. And I've got to say, it was right. Most of it is just... 90s fun, in my opinion, but the Ross and Rachel relationship was terrible. It was the worst thing ever in sitcom history. And but as for the rest of it, unapologetically, I like it. And yes, I am guilty of watching it on Netflix. I have the DVDs, and um, I will continue watching it on Netflix. Or for as long as it's on now. Anyway, that was the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and if you fancy it, leave a comment in the box down below. Until next time, goodbye.